I've noticed some pretty fierce creatures in the desert. Indeed. Though I suspect you have yet to meet the fiercest. Oh yeah? Stay afield of the Golden Scryton, noble one. It is an ancient, treacherous creature. Should you be forced to confront it, do not trust its movements. It strikes suddenly, and in quick succession. I'll keep that in mind. I can't believe Master Cordova is really here. All that time following in his footsteps. I have enjoyed getting to know him. I've never met a Jedi with a better sense of humor. You've only met me and Seer. That's right. Seer. I couldn't save Armaius. He gave his life for this. I'm sorry. I know you did your best, Cal. And the Empire? They did not track us. Hey, Scrapper. Glad you made it back in one piece. Master Kudova, did you find a way across the Abyss? No. But you may have, Cal. Boat and I were able to find some interesting data in the archives. Let's show them what we dug up. Centuries ago, the Republic established the colony on Kobol to study a stellar anomaly known as the Abyss. Santari Kree led the research team. That sea with them. Early attempts to navigate the Abyss ended in disaster. The Republic was on the verge of abandoning the project. And then guess who volunteers to fly in alone and discovers a planet on the other side? Dagon. Using the data from his voyage, Kree invented the Abyss Compass to guide others safely to Tannable. The Republic established a settlement, the Jedi built a temple, just like you said, Cal. Regrettably, a time of peace and prosperity was disrupted when Outer Rim marauders invaded. I saw them too, but how'd they get across the Abyss? They must have stolen a compass. Don't worry, we won't be so careless. Overwhelmed, the Republic abandoned Tanalor, and the Jedi Council ordered Creed to destroy the compass. Dagangara refused and rebelled against the Order. That is a Gendai. They do not often ally with other species. Looks like Ravis has been working with Dagon for a lot longer than we thought. So the Order sent Jedi to secure the compasses. Dagon murders them over it. Jedi. Killing other Jedi. But... Centauri said that Dagon was the key to Tantalor. Maybe he is young Jedi. Despite my efforts, those compasses you brought me were beyond repair. However, records indicate that three were unaccounted for. So you're saying one might still be out there? Yes, and Dagon sent his army to look for it. <laughs> I'd ask you to stay and help us, but I recognize that look. What well, look? Hope. That planet could be a haven for those who stand against the Empire. So you coming with us? I mean, Grease can make room on the Mantis. For all of you. No. This place needs me. The Hidden Path needs me. Cordova? I'm sorry, my friend. But for now, my place is on Jeddah with Seer. Let me prepare a data stick so you'll have access to our research wherever your journey takes you. Let me guess. You're staying too. When we first met, I thought that what we shared was... unique. Survivors. Fighting together against the Empire who took our families. Yeah. You helped me realize I wasn't alone. As did you. But there is a galaxy full of people who have suffered as we have. It's as Seer said. 
Perhaps you have found a sanctuary for them. Perhaps. If we can get to it. I will join you. Besides, it's been far too long since I've made Grease's hair stand on end. See you back on the Mantis night, sister. Time for us to make our move. I'm curious to hear what you make of Dagon Gara's history. Dagon felt like his life's work was being threatened. That obsession led him astray. <laughs> Sounds all too familiar. What do you mean? You may recall that I had a vision foretelling the fall of the Order. The Council. Well, let's just say that my warnings fell on deaf ears. In my arrogance, I felt betrayed. But you were right. That's beside the point. I allowed my wounded pride to cloud my judgment. When the purge began, I was still searching for proof that my vision was true. Instead of being there to support Seer and her Padawan. Good luck on Kobo, my friend. You're upset about Armias. Aren't you? Of course. But this is not the first life lost in our struggle. And it will not be the last. I know, but we were so close here. Brother Armias served the cause faithfully. And that service lives on through our determination to keep moving forward. What happens to the safe house now? It will be a long time before we can risk sending anyone to collect what remains. Cal, find Tanelor. Imagine how many lives we could save. The longer we wait, the bolder these raiders grow. What's keeping us? Kobo calls. Right. There you are. Manus is tuned to perfection and ready to go. <laughs> so where are we going? Back to Kobo. Turns out we need a special compass to navigate the abyss. A compass? Okay, sure, sure. Whatever you say, kid. Oh, and Marin's coming along. Wait, what? Mar Marin's joining us? Why didn't you tell me? I could have cleaned up the place. Oh, this is just perfect. Well, now it's too late to clean the manis. I hope she doesn't notice. Uh, Marin's with us. Go back to course. Bound. The Mantis has changed. Oh yeah, Cal and Boat, they ain't exactly the cleaning types. I cleaned this morning. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. That, that's on me. Mara, I didn't know you were coming. Hey, maybe I'll pick up some scar steaks. Why'd you join back up anyways? Seer and I believe Tanalor could be a refuge for those persecuted by the Empire. Persecuted by the Empire, huh? Gonna get crowded. All right, kids, sit down. We're here. It was horrible! Did something happen? The raiders paid us another visit. Took a shine to that droid you found. See? They took her, Cal! Carried her right out! She's been droid-napped! My saloon better be okay, Turgle. I think you brought this down on us! I'm innocent, Mr. Grease! Promise! Dagon sent them. He's after Tanalor. There must be something more to Z than we realized. Something scrambled up in her memory banks. We have to rescue her. Once he gets what he wants, he'll scrap her for sure. It won't be easy to get her back. The raider base is in the swamp. They gutted an old Luker Hulk battleship from the Clone Wars. We've seen it. Means they got a lot of firepower. As do we. She's right. Now's our time to move. I like where this is going. They already have what they came for. 
They're back at their fortress feeling safe, complacent. They'll never see it coming. Maybe not. But if you're wrong, then they'll be looking for payback. Not to worry. I will stay here and look after Grease and the others. You sure? I think you two can manage. Just don't let him swim without supervision. Let me know if you need help. Hi, Sax. Name's Mosey. Marin. All right. I'll scout ahead. Meet you there. Charging in there like a mudhorn through a moisture farm? Allow me to give you the lowdown. That raider base is inside a derelict Lucre Hulk battleship. You ever seen one? A few times. Then you know how deadly those things are. It may be grounded, but that ship is still chock full of defense turrets and reprogrammed battle droids. How do you know all this? I read a lot. Listen, just grab Z and skedaddle before the whole hive comes swarming down on you. Hmm? Thanks for the advice, Monk. Be careful out there. Now, I know you've got a lot on your plate, but one of my patrons set off to the swamp, and no one's seen her since. You don't think she went after Z, do you? Quite likely. And we both know that's Raider territory. I'll check it out. That'll put us all at ease, Cal. Zig's one of the good ones. Hope you're able to get Z back. That old research droid really livens things up around here. This place is starting to fill up, Cal. Guess the word is out. It's looking pretty good. Uh, seeing this place start to get its legs feels like... like the start of something historic. What if, centuries from now, there's a city here? Even Eldera was just a lumber colony once. Doma better start investing in urban planning. True. Turgul told me he named a road after his foot. We'll talk soon. How'd you become a music producer? I was born on Riosa, in the Inner Rim. I've heard of it. Lots of heavy industry. Yeah, and you couldn't escape the factories. So I used to make little tunes out of the noise from them in my head. You started early then. And never stopped. Hey, Too Locked. From the eye of the storm into the belly of the beast, you must go. Yeah, I know. What ails you, Sojourner? Just wondering how things would have been different if I could have stopped them from taking Z. Do your powers also include omniscience? No, but... Seek only where you wish to go, not where you long to have been. Regret is a mirage that leads many off the path. I know what you are, for what it's worth. Do you now? Sure. The way you carry yourself. That saber on your belt. I won't say anything, of course. Why not? The bounty could be your ticket off-world. And I've already told you enough about my past business to land me in an Imperial intake yard. Guess I'll have to settle for honor among outlaws. Look, I know what it's like to have a losing streak tied around your throat. And I respect anyone who keeps fighting even when the chips are down. You're a hard man to read, Moran. Then, as they say, I've still got it. See you around, Cal. I must be alone now. Heard you and Boat are gonna take the fight to the Raiders! Word travels fast around here. A daring assault on the Raider Fortress by the mighty warrior and his gunslinging sidekick to save their droid companion! Yes! Z is lucky to have a friend like you. Hi, Cal. 
Hey, we're thinking of plugging fresh energy cores into the dams at Dredger Gorge. See if we can get them working again. Not a bad idea. Where'd you learn to do that? Old friend of ours. Top-notch engineer. Had a winning smile, too. That he did. Good friend to have around. You'd think. The guy shorted us on our cut after a big take. So, Grok may have left an anonymous tip with the authorities. <laughs> yeah. Is how you treat all your friends? Don't you mind, Cal. Real friends like you got nothing to worry about. <laughs> yeah. Biomalls like that one you took out are trouble. They'll turn a room into a patio if you're not careful. I believe it. Reminds me of a pest I tangled a few years back. Nothing could get through its skin, neither. Here's the kicker, though. This creature had tentacles, too. Ooh, don't remember the name of it, but it was mean. I wasn't having all kinds of trouble until I remembered something my mama used to say. If your weapon can't fell a beast, make the beast your weapon. So, I drop my spear, grab one of the beast's tentacles, and coil it around his throat until it was over. Smart. That's what your enemies do, ain't it? Turn your strengths into liabilities. Thanks for keeping an eye out while we go after Z. If the raiders return, we will make them regret it. Reckon we're gonna get along just fine. I think so. Salutations. Go, Cal. Z needs you. Oh, hey. What's wrong, Grease? Uh, I'm just thinking about the Bedlam Raiders. Pyloons was meant to be a home away from home, but these Raiders are ruining everything. Everyone's afraid, and there's nothing I can do about it. At least people have a place to lie low. Yeah, I suppose you have a point. Besides, if the Raiders come around again, I've got your back. Oh, thanks, kid. I appreciate that. Hey, I was thinking, now that Marin's back in the crew, we could always head to Coruscant. Not that I want to. Ready to test your metal? Turns. Let me make a proper introduction. I am Bima Ook, and this is my associate, Talimu. As you can see, we have set up a game of Hollow Tactics here in Pyloon Saloon. I'm Kel. Glad you made it back safe. I'd say the same to you, but it seems there is no doubt that you can handle yourself. I see you have a companion droid. They can add to your Hollow Tactics deck by scanning combatants. Uh, got it. The more scans BD collects, the more options I'll have in the game. Exactly. Of course, there is nothing stopping you from playing right now. Now, here's the question. Do you have what it takes to best the rest of these tacticians? Hi, Peely. So far, Kobo has been a welcoming home, and this rooftop's energy drew me towards it. You feel a connection to this garden? Yes. We will help each other grow. Looks like you've already started. Divines? Yes, they sprouted overnight, but there's so much more to discover. If you plant new seeds, I'll tell you all about them. But, much like healthy roots, do not overextend yourself. Grow the plants we have, and I'll clear more garden space in due time. <laughs> 